first thing that you did, but tell me about this story because I just heard about this recently. Uh, you uh, you actually, or you were you didn't audition for Skid Row, but you had an offer to audition. So tell, what, what happened? Like your pipe burst or something? Or why didn't you make that audition? No, no, no. It, 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 and, and it's weird because I saw that interview with Rachel. Yeah, yeah. And it, that was never the case. Like, Dave, I knew Dave Sabo when I lived in Philadelphia. Okay. And I moved to California. And at that time, um, I think Dave was just putting Skid Row together. And he, he sent me a copy, like an eight track cassette of like, um, you know, I'll remember you and you've gone wild and all that shit. And, and I, I was like, wow, this is great stuff. But I don't think, actually, now that I think about it, I don't think I was in the scream yet. I think I was still in Angora when he sent me the tape, but I, I just felt like as much as I liked the songs and then, you know, according to Dave, Bon Jovi was all into the band. Right. And he was going to, he was doing, he did a production deal with him. So, um, my thing was I didn't want to, like I had convinced three other people and their wives and girlfriends and kids to come out to California. I didn't want to go, Oh, Hey man, I got this other gig. So uh, thanks for everything. I'm, I'm going back to Cal. I'm going back to Philadelphia. Okay. So I just said, I, I, I just told Dave, like I couldn't do it. Okay. So he offered so, an audition and you turned down the audition. I turned down the audition. Okay. I, I was never scheduled to audition for them. I okay. just said, no, Dave, you know, I felt really bad. I said, man, I came out here with like three other dudes and I made everybody move. And, you know, and then if I turn around and I move, they're here and we, and I'm going right back to where we all started from. I just didn't feel good about it. Okay. Personally. Oh, yeah. I felt like I was, I, I was responsible for three other people leaving their families and, all this other shit and going out to California. And I just didn't feel right about dumping that situation at that point. Okay. That makes um, sense. And the same thing with, um, Brittany Fox had contacted me. Oh, I didn't hear about that one. Yeah, no, they had contacted me when Dean left and it was the same thing. I'm like, no, I can't. I, I just in good conscience, I couldn't, couldn't do it. Okay. So the-